The Reflock Cordless Tool Kit is available in two sizes. The Kit 1 tool is able to assemble joints from a quarter of an inch to three quarters of an inch. The larger Kit 2 tool kit contains all you'll need to make joints from a quarter of an inch through to one and five eighths of an inch. First, select the correct jaw set for the connection to be made. In this instance, five eighths of an inch. The jaws are marked with the size stamped into the metal. Note that some jaws have two sizes shown on the casings. The size shown lower on the jaw is for when you're using the jaws to connect to a swaged connection. Each jaw has a groove built into the tongues, which ensures that you cannot place the jaw onto the tool incorrectly. The tongues of each jaw will click into place when they're fully located onto the tool head. Please note that on the larger Kit 2 tool assembly, tool locking screws are supplied. These need to be tightened using finger pressure only to secure the jaw to the head. When working in confined spaces, the jaws can be rotated through 90 degrees. Again, don't forget to tighten the thumb screws once the jaws have been repositioned. The Reflock tool is now ready to be used to complete a 5 8 of an inch coupling. Cut the pipe to the required length. Standard pipe cutters work perfectly. Select the appropriate deburring tool from the tool kit. Attach to a drill and deburr the pipe making sure you remove any swarf that may have entered the pipe. A reflock coupling consists of a coupling body, two inserts and two nuts. Inserts are colour-coded, so you can easily identify the correct insert for the type of pipe being used. Black, for when you need to connect to a copper stub on a piece of equipment, such as a condensing unit or a cabinet. Gold, for connecting reflock aluminium coiled pipe and silver for connecting Reflock aluminium straight pipe. Select the correct insert for the pipe being used. In this instance, 5 8 of an inch aluminium straight pipe. Place the insert into the pipe. Fix the Reflock coupling onto the end of the pipe, making sure that the pipe is fully home, and then mark the pipe. Slide the nut onto the pipe making sure that the beveled edge is pointing towards the end of the pipe. Apply lock preparation fluid to the end of the pipe. Slip the coupling back over the end of the pipe, twisting it as you do so to evenly spread the lock preparation fluid across the surface of the pipe. Offer up the nut to the body of the joint. Locate the body of the coupling to the jaws of the tool, making sure that the fitting is fully seated. Pull the trigger on the tool, making sure the pipework stays inserted in the fitting. Keep the trigger held down until the tool reaches its preset pressure limit. When this occurs, the tool will automatically return to the start position. Remove the tool from the fitting and repeat as required using the same process. That's how easy it is to form a leak-free, high-pressure Reflock joint.